Hello, good morning, guys. Um, um, I think it's probably like um, twelve a.m. in the morning. I just woke up because during the day I have to go to school. I'm serving now. I have to go to school and probably teach my students. I'm serving a government school, and most times because we have barrier of communication. Although I understand how, sir. But I don't have the luxury of, or I don't have the ability, for lack of a better word, I don't have ability to be able to teach what I want to teach in Hausa because it's not Hausa language. But I see the willingness that they, the student have to learn. So it, it disturbs me that we cannot actually communicate. We probably... Some of them do not understand what I'm talking about. And most times when a student does not even understand what you're talking about, I don't see the students learning anything that you're teaching them. That's it. But I pray that I'm able to inculcate knowledge to them because that's the ultimate thing. Okay, let's just dive in. My name is Jenny. I am the CEO of Jenny's Secret. Um, today we are going to be talking about different types of scrubs and the types of skin that needs a particular scrub. Okay, so firstly, we're, firstly, I'll, I'm going to name the types of scrub then i'm going to be telling you i'll now come back and tell you the type of skin that will use that particular kind of scrub okay number one we have um emotion scrub number two we have sugar scrub and number three we have salt scrub um so for emotion scrub emotion scrub are the scrub that are like creams. I think emotion scrub are the scrub that they have more of whitening properties. Whitening properties like um, the use of the, in there we have emulsifying wax and steric acid. Then sometimes are granul granulose. Yes, in emulsifying in emotion scrub we have ability to play inside with our whitening additives like giga white sepi white you have ability to add so many whitening additives so it's more like for whitening yeah you rub it like a cream example of um emotion um scrub we have eden yeah, we have Secret Scrub. Uh, we have Emma. Yeah, those are the example of Emotion Scrub that we have. Yeah, Emotion Scrub, eh? one of the issues that you're going to be having with Emotion Scrub is that whenever you're using Emotion Scrub, you tend to have extreme knuckles. Like you are going to have extreme knuckles. The reason is because... Emotion scrubs, granules, they are not like sharp, you get. So whenever you're rubbing, whenever you're rubbing your scrub in your hands, like it's not sharp, it's not, it's not going to, you understand, it's not going to do much work. And if you want to up your game, you have, you probably get a very sharper scrub, sharper scrub like sugar scrub or like um, salt scrub, and then you scrub your hand very well to have an even complexion. Yeah, that is that for emotion scrub. Yes, emotion scrub have more of whitening properties. And as a skincare person, you have ability to play in. You have the luxury of playing with your powders. That's it. Mm. About, and um, every kind of skin, every skin type can use emotion scrub. If you have a dry skin, if you have a oily skin if you have a normal skin if you have a sensitive skin you all have ability to oh my earring just fell off 
you have ability to excuse me you have ability to use emotion scroll and then um your sugar scrub sugar scrub is suitable for people with dry skin and sensitive skin sometimes you see your sugar scrub the liquid is on top and the granules is like on the bottom it like it separates that's to tell you that the liquid is what you used to rub on your face or probably scrub your face with then the granules on your body the reason why you go for soft scrub is that when you have a very dry skin salt tends to make it more drier and as a skincare personnel i think it's a very wrong thing probably as as an individual it's probably a very wrong thing to use a sugar scrub when you know you have a oily skin because it tends not to really make a difference when you have a sensitive skin you're going to achieve the kind of complexion you want with your sugar scrub and a dry skin we have varieties of we have varieties of sugar scrub there in the market you can get one if you have an oily skin so the the last one is our sugar scrub our sugar our so the last one is our salt scrub yeah our salt scrubs are very sharp yeah they are very sharp and they are mostly meant for people with oily skin because in as much as we don't want our skin to be very dry at the same time we would, we don't want our skin to be too oily those ones they have a very sharp granules yeah so like example of um, salt scrub we have ashanti scrub and the rest of it so that's that for scrub thank you guys for listening and Thank you for being a part of my journey. I love you guys. This is me signing out. So these are our different type of scrub. Just go for the one that suits your skin. Thank you.